Hi, my name is Tim Martin and welcome to Net101. Um, I'm a big fan of online video and I think uh, more organisations should be uh, using more of it. Um, there's a couple of reasons why uh, I do like it. Uh, firstly, um, personally I find it easier to produce video than I do writing. I, I am a capable writer but I find it um, time consuming whereas uh, I can set up this kit in 10 minutes and I can pretty much film something and have it up on the web uh, within half an hour. But um, think about video from the perspective of um, uh, people consuming your content. I mean, it's a lot easier for them to engage in it because essentially they just hit a button and the thing plays, like television. They don't have to intellectually engage in long-form content, especially if the message is, um, is complicated um, or uh, maybe requires the nuance that, that, uh, that only video can provide. But once you've got your video, um, you can do some pretty interesting stuff with it in terms of beaming it around different parts of the web. So you've uploaded it to YouTube or Vimeo. Um, it's very easy to pull it down into your website. Uh, simple copy and paste of a little uh, bit of uh, embed code and you've got streaming video on a page of your website. Uh, do the same thing into your blog. Um, but you can also start uh, pushing it around your social media platforms. So LinkedIn. Um, I mean, I'll take this video for example and, and uh, post it as a status update. Um, just post the URL of the video and the video will appear as a status update and play in line within the LinkedIn platform. I could also permanently assign that video as part of my LinkedIn profile. Uh, push it into Facebook, uh, push it into Twitter. Um, and other platforms such as uh, Pinterest, and Pinterest is not just uh, images, you can uh, actually have video boards, um, and, and Google Plus is uh, another way that you can really, um, both on your profile but also as a status update, uh, get visibility. Um, then we've got the likes of uh, QR codes. So I could uh, create a QR code that um, references a video that I've got online. Now, one example of using a QR code, I could put it on the back of a, a washing machine if I were in manufacturing space. And as a consumer, if I wanted to undo the back of the machine and change the, uh, the fan or the air filter, I could scan the QR code with my device and it would play the video that would walk me through that process. So many different applications for video. Don't just think in terms of, of sales and marketing. Um, obviously, you can get a lot of traction there too, but all sorts of things like market updates, opinion pieces, um, personnel introductions in an organization, customer testimonials, interviews. I mean, big long list. Um, I've got kit that costs no more than $500 and uh, I'm good for go. So um, yeah, look, take a second look at video if, if you've passed it by already or if you haven't really considered it, uh, maybe now's a good time.